February 14th marks the March for Missing and Murdered Indigenous Women across the country, and the Sioux is no exception. Supporters gathered at the city's courthouse to remember the lost and to help prevent further damage. On TV spoke with Wanda Trudeau, a teacher from St. Basil's who took part in this year's march. Oh, I'm here to sing an honor song, of, a song of prayer um, that I've taught children. Um, and we've been practicing it all week and singing it um, to honor the murdered and the missing uh, Indigenous peoples, not just women. It's just women because they're so highly, uh, the, the ratios are just far outnumber any other uh, race or gender, right? And for anyone that's not too familiar about what goes on every February 14th, could you give them a little fill-in? Uh, we chose that day to show, because uh, we focus on love, eh? And we want to show that um, we still want our loved ones to have the, the justice uh, they deserve. Uh, so many of them are, are neglected or when their cold case comes up, but they're just sort of just put aside and they're not, um, it's not on the top of the priority list. And you can tell by the turnout and the cars honking their horns that are coming by that yeah. people are behind you fully. Yes, what would you yes, say you've yes. learned today about the Sault Ste. Marie community and what their thoughts are behind this? Oh, just happy. I have learned to learned a good dose of happiness, how much people are in support of our people and our, what we stand for. This is just one of the things that we are standing up and speaking for, like water is one, earth is one, uh, land ex um, resource extraction, another one, uh, air pollution, another one, there's so many. And is there anything the community can take back from today to start applying in their maybe everyday life or something they can do to help with this cause? Mm, understand. Take uh, time to understand and instead of uh, just giving your opinion. Um, we have a lesson and a teaching we give to the children. Seek first to understand and be understood.